hidden around the corner <laughs> from all the big bucks that I'm, I'm making there. Um, in every great movement in history, when the people, the people, that's, that's you and me, when we stand up finally against the rich oligarchs and their minions, their institutions, in modern days, we call them corporations. Some people like to call them big business. That sector fights back, and they fight back hard. Now, just in normal times, they're just constantly, slowly chipping away at the so social contract that our um, people came before us. They built here in this country and in other places in the world. So it's just a slow, constant attack. But every once in a while, they see an opportunity. And it goes from a Cold War to a really hot war. And we're seeing that hot war right now. I don't know how many of you know, well, this makes no mistake. Uh, we're in a time where these elements in our society are being very, very effective in this struggle against the people. Uh, I think a lot of you will probably remember the financial meltdown account we just went through the two to trillions of dollars. I heard somebody say, they got bailed out, we got sold out. That's right. Yeah. $16 trillion. $16 trillion. Well, that's just still the balance. first adjustment. That's just the first adjustment of the super rich to put things back into their proper place. That's according to them. Thank so you. what's the message of the anti-democratic movement? That's the one percent. I see the signs all around here. The one percent who have 45 percent of the wealth. What are they saying to us? They're saying you are powerless. You suffer in silence. Be quiet. Go away. Die if necessary. We're going to cut off your health care. That's what they want. Die. And above all, don't organize yourselves. Don't organize yourselves. Don't demand unions. Don't organize unions. And don't collect and bargain. Too powerful if you do that. They say don't organize yourself into any group that could oppose us. Ooh. Don't demand that your government be interested in your welfare. They say the natural order of things is to protect wealth, to protect the top 
That's what everybody should be doing, worrying about that top 1%. So our union, we're public employees. in a struggle with the corporate education industry. We are one of the groups that the anti-democratic elements want to eliminate. Once we are gone, I wonder what will stand between big business and workers. Virtually all public employee unions are attacked across the country and everywhere that there's public employee unions. We stand with workers against those who would roll back the clock to medieval times where there are just two classes, the lords and the serfs. The serfs, that's going to be us. I, for one, do not want to go quietly into that that people here, assembled here today, want to push for a different world, one in which people come first over a corporation. Where a day's work gets you a fair wage, and people are working together to help one another. Where people, where people decide the direction that our lives take instead of corporations. That's right. Yeah. Okay, so what do we want? Well, we want better. Okay, fill in the blank. Why? Because everything's been eroded over the last 40 years. That's right. Longer. So we want better. What do we want better? Health care. We want better working conditions. Woo! We want better education. And above all, we want freedom. Kill your TV. We, together, we're willing and able and do work for it. We're not asking for something for nothing. Look to your left. Look to your right. And in front of you, there's a working person there. Or there's a person, a student, who is getting public education so that they can do some good in the world. And make no mistake that public education is on the way out. You're seeing, we're in the death throes of public education. Pretty soon, your that. students will be paying the full board. That's right. So, I want to close with this remark. Keep organizing. Don't listen. To Woo! Keep supporting one another. And demand the future you want. Thank you.